I was bored one day and decided I'm gonna beat Minecraft as a vegan. And here is how. So at the start, I just created a world called it Vegan Games. Of course, it's gonna be hard and no cheats. I don't need those. Really could have used those cheats. I popped into the world with immense lag and I did not start this challenge because I love animals. But I hate plants with a passion, so I destroyed every single tree close to me. Then I forgot time still passes when you're having fun because I'm a really dumb person. And I had nothing prepared for the filthy meat eaters of the world known as monsters. So I used dirt to build a small hut for me because dirt doesn't have feelings? Or at least I hope so. After that I recognized the passion that the zombies had for parkour and had to run away. Then I ate my first vegetable on top of some filthy trees. Sponsor me apples! Not a company, so they can't sponsor you. <laughs> then I saw how many meat eaters there were in this world and committed suicide. Psych, I was just going to look for a place for my house. Then I came across a huge natural disaster, but it was destroying some trees, so it kind of like was my ally. It was capitalism's fault anyway. Then I found a perfect place for my house, this little tiny island. Then I had to recreate that Star Wars scene with the meat eater, also known as a spider. But then I decided craftsmanship was more my style and went full Fortnite on this kid. After my spacious and beautifully built house was constructed, I saw that I had no food. How is anybody supposed to be vegan here? I went to go find some food, but after that decided it was the worst idea I've ever made. But luckily the skeleton had stormtrooper aim, or I was the guy from Matrix. After morning came, I slaughtered some more trees and tried to find some food for me. It was a long and arduous task, but after some time I found a village. I destroyed their property and saw what they were doing to the poor animals of the world. You are free to go, my children. No? No takers? Okay. Then I committed first degree theft and had a really hard time not pressing the M1 button. Like, could you please look less punchable just this once? I had a meet and greet with Tyler Run and found some carrot and a fellow vegan. You can tell by how we're built different. I decided it was best for me to stay close to the free thinkers, or that's at least what they want me to say they are. I built a house that had such great architecture, only veteran builders can appreciate it. And went down to mine, because that's what vegans do, right? They go mine like every other day. Then I deck for a really long time without fighting anything. Except a zombie, with whom I recreated the Star Wars scene once again. But after some time, I found a mineshaft. Let's see if this mineshaft is good or not. Oh shit, mineshaft! You about to make me a Unfortunately, my brain said go give a hug to a creeper. And I didn't build a bed. But right after some expert level navigation, I was back in business. And oh, I hit a goat on my way back. Just thought you wanted to know. Unfortunately, my second mining mission didn't go any better. I stumbled on a Super Saiyan spider and he fucking killed me! Oh, is he so fast? I'm asking for backup! But after that I got home safely. And built a farm. Carrots, of course. Carrot Master Race, oh yeah. Next up is going to Nether. So I went to look for some lava, stumbled on this ravine, went inside, didn't find anything. Just peacefully mined. <laughs> Then I got fucking mega destroyed by some skeletons. Like, look at this, that's like one second. What the fuck? What the fuck is this? I got a disc from some friendly fire and got up home safely. Oh, I also got the obsidian. Forgot to mention that. Then I went into the nether and where the fuck am I? I'm not very familiar with this new nether. So of course I had a really hard time fighting the fortress and what the fuck is- who the hell are you? Damn, this guy is tough. It was a baby? I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm alive. Still couldn't find the fortress even though I was in every biome. I did some bridging. Holy shit, that's the worst place you could ever be. Come on, just, just let me kill you. There we go. After all the trouble, I finally found the fortress. I killed some blazes because they're like plants, so it doesn't matter. And I think they eat meat anyway, so bye bye. And I had some close calls with being turned into an extra crispy chicken McNugget. From the BTS meal, of course. Uh, 
I found the vegan stream, also known as Netherwort, even though it's inedible. But it sure as hell looks tasty, so vegan. After I got all the blaze rods I needed, I went home from this portal. And I'm like 6,000 blocks away from home. <sighs> so let's go hiking, I guess. After boating some time, I found three dogs. Tim, Tom and Peter. And I was a horrible owner and lost every single one of them. What you say? But I found temple. Temples are more vegan than dogs anyway. And with that, I got a saddle and got a donkey. Then I tried to get a horse, but then I- What the fuck? How did that hit me? Okay. Well, um... What the fuck? Why are the zombies going after the horse? What the hell is going on? Whoa. What? What? What the fuck? What the fuck? Then I got a real horse with real speed. And I think I'm ready to go to the end. Oh shit. And it's time to open the portal to the melody of Shape of You, of course. Oh shit! Now we can go to the end, finally. <laughs> Alright, Eddie Dragon, fight me! I'm coming for the meat eater ass, dude! Let's go! Oh, what? I'm stuck, I'm just. No, 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 no. Oh! You don't get that kind of gameplay anymore! Anyway. With the power of vegetables! Yeah! Ah! Eat some wicked bread! Eat I think I should shoot some of this down, like, now. Let's go. First try, first try. Yeah. Oh! That's one. That's one. Another. Oh! Two, two, two! Yeah. That's a triple, that's- oh my god! Yeah. Oh. Four! Damn! I'm like that, dude! I'm like that! I'm just like that! Ah, I- oh, what the fuck? Oh, no, 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 no. No. <sighs> just got- Do you know what? Taste my water! What? Oh! Yeah, what's it gonna do now, bitch? Yeah! Come on, with the bread! Yes! Blah, blah. Let's go. So, oh, oh, oh! No, no, no. You can't hear. You can't get me with that. Just don't even try. Don't even try. It's just way too easy. Let's get you killed, and the dragon, let's get you killed. I think I'm gonna back up, back up, yep. I really I really should have brought a bow, shouldn't have I? Uh, well, glad he's coming down. Let's try a bed. Oh! No, no bed? Okay. Well, you get the sword. It's more vegan anyway. Oh, he's so low, he's so low. I think... Could I, like, go kill it right now? Let's try, let's try. Please, please, please die. I don't want another cycle. Die, die, die. Please, please, please. One more hit! What? No, 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 no. Remember, my son. An apple a day keeps the doctor away, 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 away. And with the power of being vegan, I will destroy you, wild beast! Yeah! Oh, yeah! That feels good! As always, this was for you, Team Tom and Peter. Thank God for the golden apple, though. Wait, is golden apple vegan? <laughs>